restaurant renovations, hotel renovations in Mauritius, uh, Bahamas as well, we're doing a luxury hotel and restaurants. Mostly hospitality projects, five star, four stars, and both in Dubai. Recently I have completed a design of a beauty saloon. I'm working on two hotels right now, four star and five star, and really exciting villas. I'm currently doing hands-on from landscape up until I think interiors to architecture for a boutique resort in India. Try to take risks and push yourself. Get out of the comfort zone and try new ideas and new concepts. Design involves 20% just of just having just a simple idea and then 80% you have to execute it properly. Would require a lot of uh, skills and you have to be a hard-working individual in order to be an interior designer. Actually no one said anything before I did that so it was my own choice to pursue that career and go through university. That my sense of design will constantly evolve. For me there are no design rules and um, for me the rules just limit your creativity. Conventionality. I think rules and boundaries are only limited by your own creativity. I think industrial style is still a trendy style and actually, actually it's a fun style to work with. It's a hybrid at the moment. I mean, industrial is still around, clients still want industrial, but it's sort of becoming more refined. But I think now we have to introduce new ideas and new looks. We have to redo it to be more unique to the spaces and also to match with the restaurant concept and cuisine, which is very important. Fashion and design bloggers, influencers. I don't have Instagram. That Mar and she, a lot of, they're mostly architects actually. A lot of animal pages. <laughs> design is an opportunity to continue telling a story, not to just sum up everything. Simplicity is the ultimate perfection. So there are three responses to a design piece. Yes, no and wow. Wow is the one to aim for. Less is bore. I would love to have a Redondo or a Gentry sofa from Morozo. Guerrero Chairs by Alessandro Guerrero. I need to get an Eames chair at some point. <laughs> this is the one who doesn't give you any limits. My ideal client would be more institutional, more public spaces. A client who appreciate design and details. In fashion, obviously, is, is a trend that's setting a precedent for 2019. I think every other sort of design genre will follow. They're not to be followed. I mean, they're not supposed to have trends, otherwise all the spaces will look the same. Something you look to absorb into your design, but not something that should drive it. Demanding, dynamic, but extraordinary. Constantly being disrupted. Innovative, uh, high-end and uh, unique. Progressive innovative and exciting.